Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Continuing to our Civil 3D class In our previous class We have made This is our alignment and Naming main road Then we created profile for this Alignment After that we Created Assembly because for the corridor we need assembly so we made uh, assembly then after that we created a corridor uh, if you go to the property you will see here an information parameter we have a baseline main road and um, this is the corridor from station to station and the surfaces we created on the datum and on the top one okay uh, for the top one i will write here the top one or we don't need this uh, the top surface so uh, i will delete because we will calculate the surface the cut and fill from the bottom so i will click apply and ok now it mean if your uh, cross section look like this just click on one cross section and this uh, option and this will be like this because why i delete the top one the top one will calculate from this level the cut fill actually we are calculating the cut fill from this dampum level so i left this surface as you can see there is the corridor section and the bottom surface so what will i do i will add here the volume table with this section so first of all i will remove this mm, square and this elevation from the right side so how you will go there go to the section view property and from here row style go inside and from the display turn up all the this drop down buffer outline we don't need this this uh, grid line if you need uh, if you don't need you can turn up because all the time i keep it turn up and the right right side if you can see this all right side we don't need all right side so I will turn up this all layer so it will the line I turn up also on the right side axis title I need the axis okay so now these are our uh, section with the station I will add uh, today the cut fill quantity suppose there is uh, the NGL is above and the dot below so I will check how much cut and how much fill in this uh, all section from start to 494.81 okay so uh, for that what will I do I will click here with my one of my sample line any of the sample line click here compute material uh, select simple line it asking for uh, the alignment and simple line group because I have single only one so I automatically it selected here if you can see there are many type of uh, cut fill quantity so for the new I will uh, create new artwork new artwork for the material I will come here and I will add new material here this uh, material suppose this is the cut I first I will calculate cut volume so here if you can see the record will cut and uh, repeal artwork and structure so uh, I will select cut here the factor is one the repeal factor is one and from the cut shape 
I will select here the cut material. This is the uh, shape style in the cross section. We will see the year. Okay. For the surfaces, I will add here two surfaces. One my natural ground surface and the other one the corridor done surface. The in the cut anything above the datum and below the NGL is including in cut because NGL is above and the datum is below in cut so anything below the natural ground above the road surface the datum surface it will include in cut again I will add any material this will call a fill material and fill I will select here fill and from here I will select fill material and from the surfaces I will select first the natural ground surface and here the datum surface in fill the datum surface above so anything below the datum surface and above the natural ground level it will include in fill and click apply and then ok now it's asking for it's selecting what which one is your uh, natural surface so this is my natural surface and the the corridor surface this is my corridor surface we will show it in here in this uh, uh, box so it will uh, select the for the natural surface you will select here natural surface and for the datum you will select datum then it will compute material between two and click ok now if you came here and see the section there is a line appear here a red for the cut material if I go to 50 you can see there is fill but fill it calculating below the datum line you can see only this area the cut you will see here it calculating from the the datum of the line which is uh, exactly right so here you can see only this if I select the top one it will include this one because we will not fill material to here because these are the material subgrade aggregate base and wearing core so we will only calculate this area now already if you check all the section here is H it's mean it's calculating all the cut and fill quantity so how you will add now the table here or anywhere you want because there is option in table but uh, mostly we added here on the, this right side of the section so how you will add the section on your uh, with your uh, section for that I will select the section in the right click and go to section group property here in the option you can see change volume table click here now you can see there is option there is type of the material total volume there is our style for basic uh, other one I'm using so let's start uh, select the basic and then click OK now you can see here it's selected the material list 3 because my material was uh, selected as a list 3 uh, you can change from there the name then it will appear here ok and now the location of the table you can see it uh, top right uh, top left horizontal table layout like horizontal you can adjust from this option you can adjust the table where should be appear ok so now uh, from here you can you can change the the column uh, the option you have cut volume fill volume like this if you want to add something you can remove something you can remove or add from here from here you can turn on turn on the layer the filling layer the header the header if you click here this will appear fill uh, let's try this one and click ok and then click ok then click apply and then ok now you can see a table appear here a table we have table with with all the section uh, 
so uh, for each uh, cross section there a table up here if you don't want the h uh, in the table just go to the header already it's turned on here header uh, okay so from uh, from here you can uh, change the style of the table if you have many okay first So uh, if I check the quantity of cut and fill here, we have fill, so it is a cut area, fill area, uh, cut volume, fill uh, volume, it's uh, in adding all the uh, cut and fill and the last, now cumulated fill volume is 806 and cumulated cut volume is uh, 15,284, so the net volume which will remain is uh, material we will have this one because the 800 will use in pill so the remaining this quantity okay so uh, if you want to add table to your uh, this table just click here and go to add table total volume table here material 3 the maximum row uh, put 30 click ok and click somewhere here and this table will appear here the same quantity uh, will be here the cut uh, you can see at 06 the fill quantity here cumulated cut cumulated fill it's uh, calculated okay uh, the other thing if you want to make an excel uh, sheet uh, or printing with your cross section so click here and go to general generate volume report from here you have option there is artwork there is uh, multiple material select material so select artwork and then from here uh, you can click ok now you, can, you have this uh, table here in uh, xml you can create an excel also or you can copy and uh, paste this in excel like here from this above you can copy or you can create from the option okay so uh, this was uh, today video about uh, how to add the uh, cut and fill volume of the um, cross section with uh, attached to how to add the cut fill table to your cross section hopefully uh, you will try on this uh, so this was today video okay thank you